This is Ethan Bond here with Tufts University after their loss to Bellhaven in the 2024 Division Three Women's College World Series. I want to congratulate y'all once again on making it, making it this far in the tournament. Head coach Lauren Epstein along with Michelle Edelman, Josie Steinberg, Kayla McCabe, and Rachel Moore. Uh, coach, going to you first, your thoughts on the tournament and your season. Yeah, um, you know, obviously not the way that we drew it up in the way that we wanted it to end, but um, we just talked and, um, you know, we just have a lot to be proud of. Um, you know, we'll be sad today. Um, we'll be sad that we lost, but um, this group started back in 2021 getting back to the College World Series, and, you know, their goal was to get back here. So to come here um, and to play the way we did, I think, was something that this group really wanted to do. So something that they can hang their heads high about. Um, it feels like we played with no regrets. It feels like we played our game. You know, today I think we had a bad inning and our bats maybe weren't as lively as they needed to be, but we played some great opponents here um, and we learned that we can compete with all of them. Um, and these kids sitting next to me just showed the rest of the team what this experience is like and that our program belongs here and um, how to get back here in the future. So just really proud of this group, um, proud of the season that they put together. You know, we definitely had some ups and downs and um, we'd been talking all year about just making sure that we were playing our best ball in May. Um, and you know, our program played into June this year. So that's really just a testament to the kids sitting around me um, and just proud of what they accomplished here. To all of the players, all of y'all seniors, you've had great careers at Tufts. Um, just can all of y'all talk a little bit about um, this season and your career here? I can start. Um, yeah, it's really just been a blessing to be able to be part of this program. Um, you know, not many people can say that they've gone to two World Series, one's regionals, super regionals. Um, so I think this is what, you know, at least for the super seniors, we all came back for this experience. Um, so just really proud of us um, and grateful to be part of this program. Okay. <laughs> um, no, I feel really lucky to have been a part of this group. Um, obviously been here for a lot of teams, and I think that we can all agree that this was the most special, talented team that we've ever been on. Um, and I'm just grateful I got a chance to play with them. Um, I'd echo everything that they said. Um, this is what we came back for, to get back to this stage this year. So I'm really proud of our team that we were able to do that. Um, and just feeling really grateful for all the years I got to play here um, with such incredible people, for such incredible coaches, just to be able to accomplish the things that we did, um, meet the people that I got to meet over the years. Um, and just the opportunity to keep playing softball. I'm just really grateful for all of it um, and everything that it's brought me in life. Yeah, it's definitely surreal just being able to come here as a freshman and then, or as a sophomore and then as a super senior. Um, Rach knows and I are all fifth years, and I think it's also been a really cool opportunity um, to get really close to the actual seniors. So like Kayla and I got really close this year, um, and I'm super grateful that happened because we'll be close for the rest of our lives. Um, and I also obviously got closer with Joe's and Rach this year, and it's just been such a surreal experience being super close with the team. Um, but also getting really close with the class that if COVID never happened, we never would have been a part of it. Um, my career, Josie's career, and Rachel's career should have ended a year ago. Um, so just grateful that we got to extend the year and use the year like we did and make it back to this stage. Well, thanks so much for talking to me. Once again, congratulations on making it this far, and good luck going forward in life. Thank you.